वन इज प्लेस वैल्यू वॉट इज अ प्लेस वैल्यू इन मैथ्स एवरी डिजिट इन ए नंबर एवरी डिजिट इन ए नंबर हैज अ प्लेस वैल्यू फर्स्ट वॉट इज ए नंबर एंड वॉट इज अ डिजिट ओके फर्स्ट वील अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज ए नंबर एंड वॉट इज अ डिजिट इफ वी टेक एन एग्जा द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ए नंबर कॉल टू हंड्रेड एंड एटीन ओके द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ ए नंबर कॉल टू हंड्रेड एंड एटीन दिस होल इज कॉल्ड एज नंबर टू हंड्रेड एंड एटीन इज कॉल्ड एज नंबर इफ वी टेक ओनली टू आउट ऑफ इट इट इज कॉल्ड एज अ डिजिट और इफ यू टेक ओनली वन आउट ऑफ इट इट इज कॉल्ड एज अ डिजिट एंड इफ यू टेक ओनली एट आउट ऑफ इट इट इज कॉल्ड अ डिजिट सो दिस टू हंड्रेड एंड एटीन इज अ नंबर टू विथ थ्री डिजिट्स टू वन एंड एट इज इट क्लियर द होल इज कॉल्ड एज अ नंबर एंड द इंडिविजुअल नंबर्स इन इट आर कॉल्ड एज द डिजिट्स the value of a digit the value of what the value of a digit single individual digit depends on its place or position in the number what the where the value of what the value of a digit which is a digit in this 2 1 and 8 are digits right children yes the value of a digit depends on its place or position in the number in this number the value of this digit depends on its place or position which is called as which is called as what place value see value depends on place value depends on place hence it is called as place value for example if we take this number here 345 what is the number children 345 we are going to find out the place value of 3 place value of what the digit 3 first we have to write the place values on top of these numbers which will make it easier for us to find out the place value the first place value from right is ones the second is tens third one is hundreds first is ones second is tens and third is hundreds see the digit 3 is in which place here the digit 3 is in hundreds place digit 3 is in digit 3 is in hundreds place and hence its place value becomes what 300 3, 3 is in hundreds place so its value is 300 clear the place values are ones tens and hundreds 3 is in hundreds place so what will the place value be children the place value will be 300 for your easier more easier understanding let us solve this thing let us find out the place values of numbers on this abacus see the place values are written here in the down right <coughs> it has four rods how many rods abacus has four rods 1 2 3 and 4 the first the first rod from the right the first rod from the right is for the ones it's written down here the first rod from the right is for the ones second rod is for tens third rod is for hundreds and the fourth one is for thousands now this is how many digits number is this this is a four digit number 1 2 3 4 and what will the number be we have to count the number of balls on each rod what should we do children we should count the number of balls on each rod let us count shall we okay first we'll count the number of balls in the ones place number of balls in the ones place 1 2 3 4 5 there are five balls in the ones place now coming to the tens place how many balls are there here 1 2 3 4 4 balls in the tens place coming to the hundreds place 1 2 two balls 
coming to the thousands place one two three three balls am i right there are there are five balls five balls in th ones place four balls in tens place two balls in hundreds place and three balls in thousands place so the place value of three here will be what children three thousand of two two hundred four four tens five five ones see the place value of the digit is depending on the place now what will we read this number as 3245 we okay depending on this place value we are reading this number aloud as 3245 i hope this is clear children the place values are always written from the right the first one is ones second one is tens third one is hundreds Fourth one is thousands. Okay. Let us solve some examples here. The first example we have here is 256. What is the number children? 256. Again we will write the place values on top of this number. On top of this number from right side. What is the first one? Ones. What is the second? tens the third one will be hundreds ones tens and hundreds the place value of two what will the place value of two be the digit two is in which place here the the digit two is in hundreds place so the place value will be what children come on the place value of two here is exactly two hundreds what is the place value of 2 here 2 hundreds now what will the place value of 5 be here 5 is in which place 5 is in tens place so the place value of 5 will be 5 tens what will the place value of 5 be 5 tens and then the third digit is 6 6 is in which place 6 is in 1's place. 6 is in which place children? 6 is in 1 place. So what will be, what will the place value of 6 be? The place value of 6 will be 6 1's. 6 1's. Is this clear? The place value of 2 is 2 hundreds. The place value of 5 is 5 tens. The place value of 6 is 6 1's. Coming to our second example, the number here is 7934. We have first, what is the first step? We write the place values on top of the number starting from right. What is the first value, place value? The first place value is 1's, the second is 10's, the third is 100. What comes after 100? Thousands. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousand. So, we will find out the place value starting from the first digit. What is the first digit here children? The first digit is 7. What is its place value? Thousand. The value will be 7, thousand. 7, thousands. Am I right? The place value of 7 here is 7000 as it is in thousands place. 7 is in thousands place. The place value is 7000. Coming to the next number which is 9. The next number which is 9. 9 is in which place children? 9 is in hundreds place. Now what will the place value be? The place value will be 9 hundreds. What will the place value be? The place value will be 9 hundreds. Coming to the third digit which is 3. 3 is in which place children? 3 is in right tens place. 3 is in tens place. So the place value will be 
थ्री टेंस वॉट विल द प्लेस वैल्यू बी थ्री टेंस एंड द लास्ट डिजिट हियर इज फोर विच इज इन वॉट प्लेस विच इज इन वन प्लेस फोर इज इन वन प्लेस एंड द प्लेस वैल्यू ऑफ फोर विल बी फोर वन अंडरस्टूड एवरीबडी what we'll do the first step will be to write the places above the number starting from the right side first one will be ones tens hundreds and thousands and then we write the place values of the digits in their depending on their places 7 is in thousands place so the place value is 7000 9 is in hundreds place so the place value is 900 3 is in tens place so the place value is 3 tens 4 is in ones place and so the place value is 4 ones clear everyone okay now the next topic is face value which is very very easy face value of an individual digit again what is the digit here in the number 218 two becomes a digit one becomes a digit and eight becomes a digit right the value of an individual digit is called its face value what is face value the value of an individual digit what is the individual digit here 2 is a digit 1 is a digit 8 is a digit 218 is a number the face value of a digit is the same as the digit itself what are they saying here the face value is the same as the digit itself now if we take the example in this uh, if we take the example of number 45 now we are taking the digit 4 which digit are we taking here we are taking the digit 4 4 is in which place children again we have to write the places above the number ones and tens 4 is in which place here 4 is in tens place now what will place value be what will the place value of 4 be the place value of 4 becomes 4 tens which is equals to 40 4 tens which is equal to 40 how did it become 40 4 tens is nothing but 4 into 10 what is 4 tens are 4 tens are 40 right see so the place value of 4 is 4 tens which is equal to 4 into 10 which is nothing but 40 the place value of 4 here is 40 now what will the face value be the face value is the same as the digit now 4 is the digit we are finding out the face value of digit 4 so the face value will also be 4 see the face value is also 4 face value of 4 which is in tens place is 4 though 4 is in tens place we the face value of 4 will remain to be 4 only another example the face value of 8 in 865 which digit are we taking here we are taking the digit 8 as it is mentioned here face value is the same as the digit now the digit is 8 so the face value is also what 8 right very simple right you have to just write the same digit for face value no places no ones no tens nothing we they are give, asking you the face value of 8 so you have written just 8 here even though it is in what even though it is in the hundreds place 8 is in hundreds place here right even though it is in hundreds place the face value of 8 is only 8 nothing more just 8 here 
I have put up this table for you which will make it very clear about the difference between place value and face value. Let us solve this now. The first number is 21. What is the first number here? The first number is 21. And we are going to find out the place value and face value of the digit 1. Of, the, of which digit? Of the digit 1. For face values, what did I tell you? First, we have to write the places above the number. 1 is in 1's place, 2 is in 10's place, 1's and 10's, right? First, we have to write the places above the number. And which digit are we talking about here? We are talking about 1. And 1 is in which place? 1 is in 1's place. Now, what will the place value of 1 be? The place value of 1 will be 1, 1's. Which is equal to 1 into 1. What? 1 ones are how much children? 1 ones are 1. Right. So the place value of 1 is 1. The place value of 1 is 1. And coming to face value. As I said face value no effort at all. Do not. Uh, there is no work to be done here. They are simply asking about 1. So, you simply write the same one in face value. They are asking about digit 1. So, you write the same digit in face value. We are finding out the face value of digit 1. So, the same digit is written in face value. The second number here is 823. Okay, 823. We are they are asking to find the place value and face value of the digit 2. Of the digit 2. First we will write the number here 823. And then start writing the places above the number. 1s, 10s and what comes after 10s children? Right. 100s, 1s, 10s and 100s. What is the digit given in the question here? The digit is 2. 2 is in which place? 2 is in tens place. Now what will the place value of 2 be? Place value of 2 will be 2 tens. Which is equals to how much children? 2 into 10. 2 tens are? 20. Right. So the place value will be? 20. The place value of 2 in tens place is 20. Again, they are asking you to write the face value as well. What is the digit given here? 2. So, simply we write the same digit in face values. The face value of the digit is same as the digit itself. No work to be done here. Simply copy the same digit to face value. Clear? The third one number is 1975. What is the number? 1975. What is the first step to be done? Right. Write the places of the digits on top of them. What is the first place? Ones place. Second is tens, hundreds and thousands. Now what is the digit given in the question? 9. 9. Let us circle 9 here. In which place is 9 here? 9 is in hundreds place. 9 is in which place? 9 is in hundreds place. So the place value of 9 will be how much children? 900s, right? Correct. The place value of 9 will be 900s, which is equal to 9 into 100. 900s are 900, yes. The place value of 9, which is in 100s place, is 900. Now, coming to face value, again, just copy the same digit into the face values column. 
this is a column this is the face values column so copy the same digit 9 into the face value face values are very easy right no work to be done just copy the same digit do not confuse do not get confused between face value and place value children always remember place value is always different and changes depending on the place 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 when the term place comes here you have to first write the places on top of the number and then write its value place remember the term place or else you will write the same uh, you are you will write 9 for place value and 900 for face value which will be wrong so always remember when it says place value write the places which are ones tens hundreds and thousands on top of the number and then find out it find out its value but for face value just simply copy the digit which is circled or which is asked in the question now coming to the last number here which is 5 very simple 5 5 the number of digits in 5 is only 1 they are asking you to find out the place value of 5 first write the number 5 here now write the places on top of 5 which uh, the first place is 1 that's it 5 is in which place ones place now what will the place value of 5 be 5 ones 5 ones is equal to how much children 5 into 1 which is equal to how much 5 ones are 5 right exactly so the place value of 5 will be 5 and coming to face value what i said just write the same digit for face value clear now as you have learned how to find out the place value and face value of digits it's time for you to do some problems okay now we shall do some problem uh, i ask each one of you to get a paper or a book and a pencil to write i'll give you the question you have to solve the problem and then i'll tell you the answers okay come on everybody go get a pencil or a book pencil and a book ready everyone now this is the first question for you find the place value of 6 in 642 place value of 6 in 642 now i'll give you some time solve it in your books solving everybody what is the first step to find out the place value first write the places on top of the number starting from ones tens and hundreds the in the question they are asking us to find out the place value of 6 which is in hundreds place so the place value will be 600 the correct answer is 600 so whoever has got the correct answer please clap for yourselves okay now moving on to the next question find the place value of 8 in 283 come on fast everybody find the place value of 8 in 283 See this eight uh, is in tens place, so place value of eight becomes eighty. Eighty is the correct answer. Okay, children. Now the next question is for find face value. Find the face value of five in four hundred and fifty-seven. 
I don't think you need any time for solving this. As I said, if whenever they are asking you the face value, just copy the same digit. The answer of face value of 5 is again 5 only. There is no need to solve this problem here. The answer of uh, the face value of 5 in 457 is 5. The last question for today, find the face value of 9 in 196. Very easy, right? What is the answer here? Yes, exactly correct. The face value of 9 is 9. Even though it is in 10's place, the face value of 9 will be 9. Now we have come to the end of today's class. What we have learned today, shall we revise? We have learned that every digit in a number has its own place value and place values in a 4 digit number are starting from 1's, 1's, 10's, 100's and 1000's. And the value of an individual digit is called as its face value. And what is face value? Face value is always equal to the digit, the same as the digit itself. At last, I'd like to say, please visit our website www.aimstoday.in for live class schedules, recorded videos of live sessions, so that in case you missed any of the live classes, you can go to our website and, and see the videos over there and also to get other notifications. Thank you for watching our video. Please subscribe to our channel and press the bell 